hello guys uh, so today we, i'm going to give you all a couple of examples on how to multiply uh, numbers of with uh, from 12 to uh, 19 so with any number when you multiply it with 12 to 19 you know you can follow the vedic math process and it can really become very easy so let's see how to do that okay so uh, this is the first example we have say 312 multiplied by 2 now the first thing that you have to do is you have to take the 3 will come as it is correct this 3 the first 3 it will come as it is okay now next what you have to do see with the 2 you multiply the 3 so 3 2s are 6 and plus 1 7 are you getting it what i am doing here this is you multiply this which is 3 into 2 which is equal to 6 and here you will do 6 plus 1 that's equal to what 7 you continue this process consistently and that is going to be 3 1 2 1s are 2 and then this is 2 1s are 2 and 2 plus 2 that will give you a 2 plus 2 will give you a 4 and at the end you multiply 2 2s are that will give you the last number which is equal to 3 7 4 4 so this is your final answer okay so let's see quickly let's try to do this question there okay what will you do here you will write the first 4 as it is correct then you will do 2 into 4 is 8 8 plus 1 that will give you 9 and then you will do 2 1s are 2 and 2 plus 2 that will give you 4 once again 2 2s are 4 and 4 plus 2 that will give you a 6 and 2 2s are 4 so this is the process if you take another question there this is going to give you uh, first of all you will write the 3 as it is and then you will do 6 3s are sorry 3 3s are 9 and 9 and 6 will give you 15 so 15 goes like this as a carryover then you have 3 6 are 18 18 plus 1 that will give you 19 then 3 ones are 3 3 plus 7 that will give you a 10 and 7 3 is a 21 your practically every number has a carryover so how would you do that this is going to give you 3 plus 1 will give you a 4 5 plus 1 will give you 6 6 plus 1 will give you 7 where did i get the 7 from you do the addition yourself okay this give me good this will give you 9 plus 1 is 10 so that's a 0 and 2 and to 1 so this is your final answer all right let's take a couple of more sums with different numbers okay let's take 536 with 14 what to do here so let's see once again we write the 5 as it is you see correct this 5 will come here as it is then we have 5 fours are, 4 fives are 20 and 20 plus 3 that will give you 23 the 2 goes as a carryover and the 3 comes down then you have 4 5 4 threes are 12 and 12 plus 6 that's 18 that's how you write 18 and then you have 4 6 the that gives you the 24 if you add on that's going to be 7 7 5 0 4 understand how to add that correct see if you add all this 5 plus 2 will give you 7 3 plus 1 will actually give you 8 sorry 3 plus 1 will give you 4 I'm sorry 3 plus 1 will give you 4 8 plus 2 gives you a 10 that goes a carryover and the 4 so answer will be 7 5 0 4 that's the final answer so let's erase this and we'll see if that's the final answer 7 5 0 4 correct let's take another example then 721 multiplied by 6 follow the process now come on let's do it together what will you do first of all you'll write this 7 as it is so let's write the 7 as it is correct that's a 7 then what will you do 6 7s are 42 42 plus 2 that will give you a 44 correct then 6 2s are 12 12 plus 1 that will give you a 13 then 6 1s are 6 that comes there correct what's the final answer check that's going to be 11 5 3 6 that's your answer correct add it for yourself you know how the carryovers are we have done a lot of sums in the class like this this is just because your exam is coming near and i think that you need a little practice on this okay all right now let's take one more example this is going to have all carryovers there so first of all you know the 
uh, 8 you will write the 8 as it is then 8 8 is a 64 and 64 plus 9 that will give you 70 73 then 8 9 is a 72 72 plus 6 that will give you 78 and 8 6 is a 48 what is the final answer check that will be 161 one. how do you get 16 with all the carryovers because this if you add you have 8 plus 7 that gives you a 15 then 7 plus 3 that gives you a 10 then 8 plus 4 that gives you a 12 and that gives you an 8 so that's 16128 that's your answer okay now let's try a couple of sums this is very easy guys let's try to do a couple of sums there you know that will just make you feel that you know it a little better okay the first number as it is 5 now do it in your mind 6 5s are 30 30 plus 2 that's a 32 6 2s are 12 12 and 6 that give you 18 6 6 are 36 36 plus 2 that will give you 38 and 6 2s are 12 what is the answer check for yourself 5 plus 3 will give you 8 2 plus 1 will give you 3. 3 plus 1, you know there is a carryover coming in. So, 3 plus 1, that will give you a 4. 8 plus 3 is 11. 1, you already had a carryover. And 8 plus 1 is a 9. And then you have a 2. Okay, let's do this question. 7, you write as it is. Now, 3 7s are 21. 21 plus 2 will give you 22. Now, 3 1s are 3. 3 plus 3 will give you 6. Then, 3 3s are 9. And 9 plus 4, that gives you a 13, that goes a carryover. 3 4s are 12, and 12 plus 2 will give you a 16. Sorry, 3 4s are 12, and 12 plus 2 will give you a 14. And 4 3s are 12. Final answer would be 9, 2, 7, 4, 5, 2. Correct? Now let's write the next one. You write the 2 as it is. Then... 9 2s are 18, 18 plus 1, you get a 19. 9 1s are 9 and 9 plus 4, that gives you a 13. 9 4s are 36, 36 plus 3, that gives you a 39. And 9 3s are 27. So that gives you how much? 2 plus 1, 3 plus 1, 4, 0. 3 3s are 6, 6 plus 1, 7, 11. And uh, 7, 4 0, 7, 1, 7. Okay, let's do one more question there. Uh, so we have... You write the 6 as it is. Now, 6 8s are 48. 48 plus 5, that gives you a 53. 8 5s are 40. 40 plus 1, that gives you 41. 8 1s are 8. 8 plus 3, that gives you 11. 8 3s are 24, plus 4, 28. 8 4s are 32. Check what your answer is going to be. That's going to be 1, 1, 7. 2, 4, 1, 2. Correct? I hope you guys understood this. We have done many sums like this in the class. Just practice a little more. Open your booklet. The entire booklet is with you. Practice these sums. They are very easy guys and very helpful for your day-to-day -day schooling as well. Alright? Okay then. Thank you so much guys. Wish you guys all the very best uh, for your upcoming exam. Yeah, this is all the best for you all. And thank you guys. Bye-bye.